Hello and welcome to another episode of Engineer's Thoughts, an ongoing series where I go over and review weapons in TF2 that aren't specifically made for the engineer, reviewed for an engineer main's perspective. Today's episode is about the black box. The soldier is a pretty interesting class. Sometimes it can be really easy to play and fight against, but other times it can just be a pain. But for the most part though, the basics of actually playing soldier is pretty easy to learn, and that's probably why so many people main him. He's as iconic as the heavy, but we're not here to talk about the soldier himself. As the title and introduction suggests, we're gonna go through a weapon that seems to be really hated but also loved at the exact same time. What happens when you mix the power of the rocket launcher and the healing power of the sandwich? Well, you'll probably come out with a black box, a literal box that I'm pretty sure is ripped off in Saints Row 4. Probably not though, considering it's based off an M202 flash. The black box's core functions are identical to the stock rocket launcher, with just one key difference. Unlike the stock launcher, the black box lets you heal up to 20 health per attack. It says up to 20 health because it all depends on how much damage you've actually dealt. Sometimes you could heal up to 20 health, or you could just deal up to 5 health. All you need to do is shoot a rocket and hope the splash damage hurts somebody, and there you go, you healed up a bit. The only downside to this weapon is that instead of being able to fire up to 4 rockets, you can only fire up to 3 at a time. Only having 3 rockets at a time can put you off a lot, especially when rocket jumping. Being so used to being able to fire 4 rockets kind of puts me off this weapon. Also because of that, I feel like I'm constantly reloading, but that's probably because of my own personal playstyle and not the fault of the weapon itself. As a quick summary, you hurt somebody to make yourself feel better. To some, the black box can be seen as a direct upgrade, some see it as a crutch weapon. To me, I just see the black box as just a weapon, although I do somewhat agree with people who call it a crutch weapon, especially when paired with the conch, another soldier weapon that heals you, and passively too. If you don't know what that means, the conch gives you health by just simply having it equipped. And like I said earlier, the black box also gives you health by just hurting people with it. Health regen can go a long way, that's why the medic passively regens health. People say playing with the black box conch is like playing on easy mode, and I do have to agree with that. Power classes like the soldier shouldn't have a health regen mechanic. Imagine if the heavy passively regen health, it would just be unfair. The black box on its own is fine, it's just when paired with a conch it gets a little annoying to fight against. It's too good of a combo and it just makes an easy class that little bit easier. Even though I'm terrible at soldier, I just feel dirty playing with the combo. Although I can say one thing, the conch box combo isn't as powerful as I made it out to be. For one simple reason, the conch ain't a shotgun. A shotgun is way more powerful than a little health regen, and anyways, on most maps there are a lot of health kits, so unless you're playing on a map that doesn't have that many health kits or there isn't a medic on your team, then there isn't really a point in using it. Thinking about it like this, you're giving up 7 opportunities, 6 if you're not using a black box, to kill someone just because you want to stay alive for that little bit longer. At least with the other two banners they actually have stuff that are helpful for the team. Their conscious speed boost is really lackluster, but its ability to heal people is pretty good though. In my opinion the conch is just for selfish people and the conch box combo makes it even more selfish. Anyways, now that my little rant about the conch is out of the way, this would be the part of the video where I talk about useful weapon combinations that would fit in with the black box. But the rocket launcher is so similar to the stock rocket launcher that it doesn't really matter. Every weapon that you'll normally use with stock you can use with the black box and it works. Although I guess the shotguns shine a little bit more because of the one less rocket the black box has and we've already talked about the conch a lot today. Now what do I actually think about the black box? Well I like it. It's a true side grade to the rocket launcher and I guess the original as well if you're counting that. Believe it or not I actually like the health regen mechanic that the black box has. It's just when mixed with the conch that it becomes kind of overkill. I don't think anything really needs to change about this weapon, it's perfectly fine the way it is. Like every other weapon in the game, it has its flaws, but that's what makes it unique. If you don't like those flaws, just switch to a different weapon. The only complaint with the black box is its synergy with the conch. I think that the health regen on the conch was slowed down a little bit when I quit the black box. Maybe instead of regenerating every second, it regenerates every 2 seconds instead of something. Then I'll probably like the combination a little bit more. Long story short, I like the black box, but I don't like the conch box combo. You know what else I like? I like subscribers, so uh, yeah, subscribe. Also join my Discord, I think that's cool. Also I have a Twitter too, I guess. All links are in the description. Thanks for watching this video, it means the world to me. Anyways, yeah, bye. Try. <laughs> <laughs>
Hey. Fuck! That was good timing. <laughs> I just see it. I just see it fall down. No, game 